Okay, hello and welcome everybody. Today's video is going to be for Total War Arena, and I will be covering our lovely commander of Milates, which is a Salt Disruptor. I've got him to tier 2, so I've got the Craftsman, which is the Siege Engine, basically Scorpion, not that great. And we've got two Spear units as well. Just trying to get him leveled up at the moment, so we can get to tier 3, tier 4, etc, etc. We get some better units, but I thought I'd try them out. Obviously, barracks wise, these are the units we can get as tier two, same as the Alexander the Great general or commander, and we're playing as the Greeks. So, Victory is assured. let's try it our the first. Fights for you. Let's try our first bit of artillery and see how it goes. Obviously, it's not the best one, so they probably get absolutely wrecked. But from what I've learned from previous battles, you need to be in the line of sight, so you have to be in the open to fire and stuff like that. I was. Doing it off a cliffside, which obviously didn't let me fire off. Some some rubbish like that. You have to have a clear path to fire with the scorpion, that is. I don't know about the other artillery. I assume it's probably not that thing for it. Also, if you haven't checked them out already, there's been a Total War Attila DLC release, or Rally Point video today, which I've done a video about, called The Last Roman. Go check out that video. I've also got some mod impressions, uh, quite a few recently. I think I've got three videos now. If you want to go check them out and obviously just go check out my other content. If you're new to the channel, hit, give us a like on the videos. It also, always helps me out. Comment, tell me what you think about Arena itself. If you're enjoying it so far, what commanders you're playing as. And obviously, hit that subscribe button. There's plenty more content coming up soon. I'll be doing some videos for the Total War Tiller patch, which is going to be released. Obviously, anything new for Arena. So, once I release the Barbarian commanders and stuff like that. And obviously, just general matches that I'll be playing. So, plenty of content coming to the channel. Let's see what we're coming up against. But I'm going to try and play at least one match for all the commanders, and then I'm just going to play Germanicus again so I can get up to tier 5, tier 6, because I'm on tier 4 at the moment for Germanicus. I want to try and get some better sword units for them and obviously we'll increase from that but I'm going to try every single class the probably next one I'm going to do is Caesar so as we do the siege engineer one but and obviously same as the barbarian as soon as they get released then I'll be playing as them let's see who we got no one I really like, recognize on my team and what about the Raptor Jesus who was in the last match I don't know who anyone else is though and we've got a computer one as well, CPU 19. But we're facing... Germanicus is a lot of heavies. One siege engineer, which would be a support engineer, which is the Caesar one. And we're playing on the map of Salernum, which is obviously the sea map. Also, they, they were saying they may bring some new modes to Arena at some point. Obviously, this is in the distant future. And obviously, loads more new maps, hopefully. Which should be good. They're also thinking about doing different time periods, I've heard. But again, this could be like way in the future, so bear that in mind. But at the moment, they, they obviously can do medieval, they can do other things as well for Arena. Which would be pretty cool, but we'll see how things pan out. But again, that would be like... It's not going to be for like a year, two, three, four years, depending on how long the franchise goes for for Arena. But if it does kick off and goes very well then that's something we could uh, potentially have, which would be pretty cool. We've got three generals the same as mine. Milates, including myself, on my side. So let's see what they got. We'll see what they get in a minute once it loads up. It's taking a while. There we go. We've got a couple of artillery units, including myself. But he's tier 3, so he's going to be slightly better. But I need to set up about here, i say. So I can get a bit of range. I'm going to try and defend the base. So I've got two spear units, and obviously I've got the artillery. We might be able to do some damage, but this artillery is going to be crap, to be perfectly honest. But we'll see what we can do. Seems like a lot of our guys are going to go through the city. <laughs> I 
And we've got a lot of archers again. Uh, quite a few. Mixed bag, actually. Mixed bag. Mixed bag, indeed. Understood. At the double. For Greece. Move. This game on the hill, actually. By your command. At speed. Defender of Greece. So they're pushing up with that. Obviously, we're playing more of a defensive role than we normally would. Normally, we'd assault, uh, assault the enemy, but hopefully, we can get these to kick in. But obviously, scorpions. So it's not like we've got onagers or anything yet, but we can build up into that. So this is not going to do that great deal of damage, to be perfectly honest, but... Orders understood. Let's move him up fully. There we go, we've got some action yes, over here. On. So I may move this guy over. For Greece. Ready for orders. So, visibility range is 75, range of attack is 160. For honor and great glory. Understood. Your orders. Let's move him up a little bit. At your service. Leaving ourselves very open for our base, but I think we'd know if they're attacking or not. They've got quite a lot in the city, actually. So we need to move back if we need be. Once we've taken this lot out, we'll move back. Let's charge in and help out with this lot. We await your command. Okay, we got some. Yeah, we're getting some shots in now, which is good. Elected general. Okay, we're gonna stop firing for that. At the devil. Defender of Greece. For glory. We'll take these three units out and then we'll pull back a little bit. So obviously we need to see what they're doing in the city. They're going to push up in a little bit. For and we start getting artillery to fire. Not the best for the artillery, but you know, for what they are, they're only scorpion units. It'd be the same if he's playing Rome 2 or Tiddo, etc. Let's get some cheap kills. Let's move him up a little bit so he can start firing. Get at them. For Greece. Okay, let's get to firing on him. And you can start firing on that dude. Elected 
It's getting fire at them units. Uh, I think we're right actually. We're pretty much taking control here, so we don't have to defend. For glory. Well, kind of treat it like a archery unit in a sense. Let's get some good kills out of this. They're, well, we might have to retreat back to take out this lot, but to they're pretty weakened, so we should be fine. We'll finish off these units. Let's pull them back. Let's help out with this. Why are you fighting at me for, you pillock? And then we'll push off into the city. Well, it looks like they're pretty much done for anyways. We might push up to towards their base, actually. Let's push up towards here. Okay, stop moving up. Onwards and upwards. They're most likely going to rush, rush back to their base now. Here we go. They've got their archers coming back. Let's try and get my guys to move in a little bit so they can be in range. They might not be able to do anything, but move up to about here or so. For Greece. The devil. Let's try and cut these guys off. Range, but I am the servant of Greece. Okay, we've got some de decent archers that we need to take care of, so let's fire up on, on them. Defender of Greece. Attack! For Greece! Attack! Let's go for them, let's actually charge. Victory for Probably done it a bit too early, but. They're getting fired upon by archers anyway, so let's chase after them. Let's help out with this guy. I am the servant of Greece. Oh, this is way definitely in the bag. Let's get some kills out of it. Haven't done the best though, but then again, there we go, we're going up a little bit now. For glory. Elected General. Oh, we've got a unit over here. Let's go to the back of them. Come on, let's get some kills. Pack them down. 
with each step, bear courage in mind. Honor and great glory! Kill them all! Elected General. I do like the icons now though, they've changed that since uh, I played it last. They've done a little patch for that. You know, getting up there with the kills, obviously. More kills, more XP. Obviously, the other guy's done really good. 3,000. So. Well, point wise, but you know what I mean. But there you go, I did have artillery unit. There we go, victory. Onwards and upwards. So we've got quite a bit of thing come from that. Unit XP and command XP, but that is basically just showing off the artillery units. Obviously it's not the best unit in the world, but we can obviously get some better upgrades. But same aspect as Alexander the Great, but obviously you can start off with certain units and you have better command abilities. Obviously I'll move up into that later on. Could do raise shields, fear stuff like that but we'll get more abilities as we go along the assault disruptor pretty good it's obviously similar to alexander the great but you know that's how it is with this but i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you all in the next one for the next commander i'll see you all next time